19-year-old Judiah Dixon stood handcuffed before a judge in Providence District Court to face a first-degree murder charge for the shooting death of Richard Arenas in June. Eran varias, varias cosas que había que tener en cuenta, decía. Una era eh, segregar siempre mucha saliva para que todo esté lubricado. Después, ¿qué más decía? Que había que acordarse de... Chicos. ¿Eh? 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 Cuando estaba viniendo para acá, me tocaron bocina al menos cinco fleteros. ¿Podés creer? Yo decía, por Dios, que me toque aunque sea bocina, no sé. Ahora pruebe con la otra. Dele, dele. Five men surround Esvin as he was making a delivery. They threw him to the ground and began to beat him up. They steal $70, take his e-bike, and then they stab him in both legs. To give them everything, or else they'll kill me. Of one of the suspects, in hopes that someone recognizes him. Even with these stab wounds in both legs, Esvin managed to make his way back to the pizzeria for help. Esvin paid 500 very hard-earned dollars for that e-bike that was stolen. Him, police say, is this man you see walking down Elliott Place, where he followed a 27-year-old woman into her apartment, slammed her up against a wall, and attempted to rape her. The young woman received a slight laceration to her face, but hopes the suspect takes responsibility himself.